Hello everyone, I'm Sir Jim Cord, your research teacher. Four star, I hope you are all doing fine. We are now on the last four of practical research two. We are talking research question. Shout out to the Drop your comment. Don't forget your section. Let's get started with your students. This lesson, you have to accomplish two things. One is to state research question. The other one is to present statement. In the previous learning activity sheets and video lessons, we've been talking about qualitative research, quantitative research, variables and designing research and this time we have to deal with research question what do we mean by a research question what is a research question a research question is simply a question related to your chosen that needs to be answered okay it is the question where your study reviews. so meaning you have in we go back to your chosen app, you know, make a good research question. So later, we will be talking about what are the characteristics of a research question, okay? Suppose you have decided to choose use of social media as your research topic. The following could be your research questions. One is, why do teenagers make up the largest percentage of students? Or how does treatment use on affect social? You can also deal with Facebook, Twitter, Twitter. Okay, so those are the possible research questions that might be derived from a topic on, on social. Now, how do we formulate a research question? There are four steps. First step is choose a topic. You have to choose a topic you're interested in since you will be working on it for some. First consideration is your strand or your track. For ABM student, try to consider topics dealing with accountancy, business, and management. If you are a STEM student, you have to consider science, technology, engineering, mathematics related topics. If you are a TVL student and under beauty and air care and cookery, electricity, electronics, CSS, you have to consider your strength okay if you are an a and d students an art and design student so you have to topics related to and design are a young student or a humanities and social sciences student have also to consider topics dealing with humanities and social sciences if you are a gas student there are several topics which can be considered general academic strength Okay, so try to consider your strength or track. Will not be lost. Another is narrow the topic. After choosing a topic, you now have to narrow the topic. Choose a certain aspect of your topic to one on. So it's not the broad one. The broad you have to narrow it down okay so you have to choose a certain aspect of that topic or in on this one then ask some question think of some question you can ask about it and this time after asking a question you then again ask the question pick one and try to make it more specific and relevant 
Let's have an example. Okay. Consider the topic on mental health. Okay. You have chosen a topic. That's the first thing. Then, you have to look into what aspect you'd like to focus on. Subtopic could be depression and anxiety on teenagers. And we're done with the second step. Going back to the uh, steps on how to formulate research question. The third one is you ask question. Okay? Then you ask question. There are two questions formulated by the researcher here. One is, how does depression and anxiety affect teenagers' academic performance? The other one is, what effect do school policies on bullying have on the number of cases of depression among high school students? And try to focus on one question and try to be relevant and specific. This time, the question would be, what effect the anti-bullying app on 30 have on the number of cases of depression among teenagers in Philippine public schools. Want to narrow it down and be more specific, you can use your school. Example, what effect the bullying of 30 have on the number of cases of depression among teenagers in Digao National School? Or, want it a little bit bigger in SDO Igao City or in the schools or in schools of SDO Igao City. After choosing a topic, do some preliminary readings to find out topical debates and issues about it. This will also help you narrow down your topic and help you think of relevant research questions. Take note of these characteristics of good research questions. Questions should be first researchable, feasible, specific, complex, and relevant. Yes, we're done with the discussion on what is a research question, the steps on how to write research question, and the characteristics of good research question. Take note of this key point. Research question is a question which states the aim of your research and it's exactly what you want to find out. After writing the research question, it's now high time to write the statement of the problem. Stating the problem helps the researcher clarify the essential elements of research, which include the major variables, the general and specific objectives, and the appropriate methodology. Important elements in the statement of the general problems are one is main tasks, two main or major variables, three participants, four setting, five coverage date, and six intended out. This is for developmental research. Let's have this one as an example of a general statement of the problem. Mary. The main problem of this study is to look into the influence of video games and the utilization of social media on the language proficiency of the freshman students of the Gao National School for school year 29. The results of this investigation will be the basis for formulation of the guidelines in the development, organization, implementation of effective study habits. Okay, let's look at the main task. What is the main task? The main task here in the given general statement of the problem is to look into the influence of video games, the utilization of social media and language proficiency of freshman students. The major variables are the influence of video games, the utilization of social media, the language proficiency. Another is participants. Who are the participants? These are the freshmen students. Setting is Ligao National High School. The coverage date? School year 2019-2020. And the intended output, since this one is a developmental research, is the guidelines on the development, 
organization and organization objective study audits. See all you need to see with consider in a statement of the problem are present from main task, major variables to participants to setting coverage state and to intended outcomes. We can now write the statement of the problem. Look at these three questions. This deals with a topic on online learning. The statement of the problem are as follows. The specific questions will be what issues and challenges on online learning are encountered by students and teachers living in the city of the region during the presentation of one's community? And is there a significant difference on the issues and challenges encountered by the students and the teachers? Another is what program can be proposed based on the findings of study? Another is on the topic effectiveness of boost glass leaf extract in regulating the blood glucose. These are the specific questions. What is the hypoglycemic effect of glass leaf extract hypoglycemic albino mice? Two, is there a significant between drug and the experimental? Yes, we're done with another one, which is the statement problem. Take note of this key point. Statement of the problem contains the general problem of the study, which is restated with specific details in participants, setting, and the period by the study. Let's have an activity. Direction. You have to comment a smiley face or colon, close parenthesis, if the given is a good research question and colon open parenthesis or subface if not are you ready i'll be reading the question first then i'll give you three seconds to comment your answer or to write your answer on your notebooks are you ready Let's have this one. What are the study habits of students who are poorly performing? Is that a good research question or not? Your three seconds starts now. What is your answer? Okay, congratulations. You got it right. Next, how do senior high school students respond to their math teacher? Is that a good question or not? Three seconds starts now. Okay, what's your answer? Let's see. Smiley face, that's a good question. You got it right. Congratulations. Next question. Should high school teacher be watchful over their grade 7 students? Is that a good research question or not? Three seconds. What's your answer? Let's see. That's not a good question. Sad face. You got it right. Congratulations. Another. Are family members helping their children in reviewing their lessons? Three seconds. What's your answer? Time to reveal your answers. Let's see, got it right. The answer is a sad page. That's not a good question. Okay, take note of the characteristics of a question. 
Okay, if you can see that there, therefore that's not a good question. Let's have the last one. What are the common preparations done by grade 7 students during their first days in school? Is that a good question? Research question. And your answer? Okay, let's see. Time to reveal your answer. What do you think is the answer? Is a smiley face. That is a good research question. Congratulations for those who got it right. Now it's your turn. You have to do the performance task one on formulating your own research question using the flowchart and write your answer on a separate sheet. Another is performance task two. You have to supply the information as in the table considering the general problem. This study aims to assess the level of performance of technical vocational instructors and relate it to the efficiency of senior high school management students undergoing on the job training in selected businesses and validate school year 2015 and use the table to no. show. And it's now time to write your statement of the problem. Don't worry guys, you just have to write everything then we will take turns. We are your friendly practical research to teachers who will take charge of checking your thoughts. We will be providing also comments online or offline. So don't be shy. Just write everything. Okay? And this is the rubric for grading your research. Question. Guys, don't forget to look into the WHLP for this week for you to be guided on what to do and what to be submitted to us. Feel free to contact subject teachers and ask questions that need to be carried. Okay. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your active participation in today's lesson. See you next time. Have a good day. Gandhi.